Craig, you mean that sixth place finish today at Charlotte? Just talking through your race and how much you learned out there. Definitely learned a ton. I mean, this track is extremely intimidating, especially compared to Kansas. You know, Kansas is so smooth and kind of open. Here, it's so bumpy. And we, you know, the balance of the car was a little off at the start of the race. Like, the, the bumps upset the car so much that I kind of lost confidence there. So I, I went back in the field a little bit. But we actually pit three times and made changes, you know, and got the car better and better and better. And, you know, on that last restart, just kept my foot in it while everyone was getting crazy and drag race to the finish. And I think I passed four guys coming out of four. So I'll take it. You know what I mean? We need every position as possible. But it's just another one of those things of, like, you know, I feel like I belong in this series and, and hopefully people, you know, are, are, will, will respect that and we can keep kind of moving forward, you know, but I'll take what I learned today. I, I, I did learn a lot, you know, more in me, more with how to give feedback about the car, but uh, I don't know, I loved it. It was cool. Does it help that some of these racers are more spread out than, the, you know, the Xfinity and trucks and all that so you can prepare for someone who's new to this? I actually think it's the opposite. I think for me, like I leave the racetrack like right now feeling like, I got this, I can do this, I belong here. And then by the time we have the next race, I go, which one's the gas pedal? You know what I mean? Like it's so far in between. So I'm actually excited to get to the part of the season where we are in the in the race car more. Just so then it's uh, less where I don't get my mind out of it for a while. You know, I go back home, I'm building a house, I got this stuff going on, I got a baby, and you know, then I gotta get back in race mode. But I just wanna stay in race mode as much as possible. So, so um, I must have missed it earlier when we talked about it, but you finished uh, six to nine, so after running around 11th or so. Yeah. Uh, what what How'd you get the rockets on the car to get up there? I mean, to, to be honest, you know, they made the call to come in and pit for tires for that overtime. Uh, it was definitely the right call. Like, I wasn't gonna fight it. You know, I know they know more than I do, but I thought like, oh, we're gonna lose so many positions. But really, a lot of a lot of cars did. But in the end, you know, we I just kept my foot in it. Like, it got squarely through four. The people were all paying in, and and uh, I kept my foot. In it. I, I literally think I passed four guys coming out of four. You know what I mean? So, um, you know, I beat some good cars, and and. Uh, you know, that, that feels good. <laughs> What's the experience racing out there in a pack like that? Because, you know, some drivers talk about the etiquette out there. Um, Greg, Greg Mandel is pretty upset at a, at a con or stuff. Or yeah. Happened. What's your experience, especially someone new to this, uh, with the uh, etiquette out there? I, You know, all in all, like, I haven't, you know, knock on wood, been involved in too many, you know, I, I think I'm the only person who's completed every single lap. I got hit today by the 45 when Von, when Al spun, the 45 came into me and hit me. I thought we had damage, but we were okay. Um, all in all, like the tough thing for me is like, even when we're lapping cars that are a fair amount off the pace, that's where I struggle. Like I need to get better at just being aggressive, going to that middle, going to the high side and just driving around. I'm, I kind of tiptoe around them. And that's where I would, the, the, the guys in front of me, like the, the really good cars in, in, in this series, they just get by them. And I, I lose 10, 15 car lengths getting around them. So I need to work on that. My restarts were so much better today. Like I think I had, I don't think I had a bad restart today where in the past I've lost like a bunch of positions on restarts because I spin the tires. So at least I uh, improved there. And that's the thing, I got to keep keep improving every time. But you know, this is only my ninth oval race in the, my career. You know what I mean? I'm here at Charlotte Motor Speedway. It's an intimidating place. So I've got a lot to learn, but I'm uh, I'm, I'm going for it. As long as we keep finishing races, I'm, I'm learning, you know, you know and, and we'll be good in the points and we'll be right there and hopefully to capitalize uh, if, if other people don't have the best luck too. Thank you.